So heading to our next visual component would be EVAP, which we mentioned on the video earlier. So let's go ahead and take a look how to find it. We know we're using our white book, so let's head on to it. We see here, we got Toyota. We see it's a 1993. You wanna take a look, your proper vehicle, proper identification. We follow the 1.6. We already checked we had PCV, it was there. So we see there we have an EVAP system as we see. So now we go ahead and take a look at the EVAP. So we walk over here to the vehicle. We're gonna to wanna to need a flashlight for this step, guys. So let's get our flashlight. We see here, we wanna go ahead and turn it on. Got our flashlight on and let's head over. So we see here on this vehicle, it's a 1995 or older, we're always gonna have our canister mainly in the front. As we see here, we have our EVAP canister in this location. Our EVAP canister is one of the main components you wanna look for on vehicles. It's hard to find, but on this vehicle, you can locate it. As we see here, we wanna look at the canister itself, make sure it's not broken, make sure it's there. We wanna make sure our hoses are connected to it. As you see here, you wanna to come to the hose and tug on it, make sure it's sealed and proper. As we see, that is there. And then as well, your plastic molded hose. You wanna make sure it's connected and sealed to the vacuum tank as well. So we see there, our EVAP component components are fine. That is just part of them. As we're gonna walk towards the rear of the vehicle, we're gonna check our EVAP gas cap as well. But before we head to there, we're gonna take a look at our personal and electronic control solenoid. As we see here, this one right here is called our personal oil. We wanna make sure it's connected to vacuum and as well as headed to our EVAP canister. And the electrical connector is there. It's a, it is all there, so now at this point, let's hold it ahead and head to the back. As we head to the rear, we wanna open up our gas tank. You wanna turn on your flashlight, open up your gas cap. You wanna inspect the actual gas cap itself. You wanna take a look at the O-ring. As we see here, you wanna put the light on the O-ring and take a look at it. As you see, it's nice and intact, nothing wrong with it, nothing wrong with the cap, nothing wrong with the thread. So we see we have a passing gas cap. As we see here, that will let us know that our EVAP system would be a passing today. So let's go ahead and head to the next component, guys. Oh, my God. 